good morning uh it is 11 degrees and i know you guys are like whatever where you are i'm in north georgia so you guys are like studly whatever you don't care but this is ridiculous it's 11 degrees out here no thank you i had gas regulators just freezing up on the roofs we're not wired for this we are not wired for this um they close schools it's anyway what I'm trying to say is it's cold. Welcome back to Taylor. Um, what I'm doing is before I, I'm going to replace this contactor, I'm actually going to run a test to see because I'm really torn because one of you made a, a great point, and that is these Lovato contactors, they have a, a much kind of heavier duty Uh, contact in there for all the on offs that it does I mean sometimes there's a reason it's and there's no need for it to be as expensive as it is but there's a reason this costs more than a regular old you know three pole contactor uh, but before I get into that we're actually gonna clean the machine as well and I have somebody who's behind me who's gonna swoop in and do that but before uh, I, I'm gonna unplug the machine to do my work I just wanted to flush water through the system so that when my backup gets here, it's empty and he can pull it apart because if I kill it, he can't use the pump to clear out the mix and all that good stuff. So, good times. Uh, what I'm gonna test to see, right, is this, this, third, this third circuit is what's dead. Um, and I'm curious if it's only the third circuit that's dead. I've done this on another ice cream machine, Electrofreeze, with the same um, setup is I've just moved it over to the fourth set of terminals and used one, two, and four. So if I can do that, which I'm just gonna, I'm gonna kill the power and then I'm gonna unhook my load wires and then I'm gonna test continuity across. And if I have continuity on one and two uh, without any uh, odd resistance showings, then I'll check four, and then we'll just move the third legs over. I'll cut that wire, put a new head on it. We'll see. I've got the unit off. Don't lose your minds. Uh, I don't have enough hands, so I want to hold the meter. I don't want to hold the phone, and I want to push in the contactor. But I want to show you. Um, we are on okay. I want to show you, uh, and I tested voltage everywhere. Why I said you have to unhook the load sides of things. So if we just test across, we're gonna go, hey, all right, so I've got on continuity. Hey, we got no resistance. We're good on line one. Hey, we're good on line two. Hey, we're dead on line three, which we knew. And we're good. Uh, hang on, I missed it. And we're good on line four. I just dropped the contactor. Meh. Uh. What I was trying to show you, and I can't get it to hold anymore, <clears throat> is that you think you've got continuity across, but the reality is I could go to one and two and hit it and get continuity because everything's rolling through the windings, right? So I can go from one to three and get continuity. So if we're actually gonna test the contactor, right? Now, granted, this does let me know that my one is good across, my two is good across, my three is no good across, four is not gonna ping because there's no wires on it, there's nothing there. But uh, I'm gonna pull these, I'm gonna cut this back, we're gonna try and move it over to four and then test some things out, see how that goes. All right, so one, two, four, one, two, four. Um, we've got this full of water, so we don't really want to run it, but I do want to see. Click, compressor, 11 amps, 10 amps, 9 amps. That'll get you through. Um, I am going to order, I mean, look, we've got eight contactors here. Uh, this is a location I deal with on the regular. These units are, I don't think it tells you on Taylor's nomenclature, no. Gosh, four years old? I think the store is four years old. 
Um, so we're getting to that point. So I'm just gonna grab a couple, keep them, and that way we can replace it. Like you can you can buy yourself time with uh, with that trickery right there. And now I don't have to put in some janky. Right, I was gonna just put in a a regular three pole, but all right. Well, let me finish cleaning this up, and we should be able to get it up and rolling today. So we are sanitized, primed, ready to go. Auto, auto. So the beaters pull in immediately, and then shortly thereafter, compressors. Let's go, baby. I'm gonna get this buttoned up, and we're waiting for ice cream. Bring back the chocolate soft serve. Back to life.